Welcome to Wipes Tube Arsenal 4 Leeds 2 Alioski, what are you saying bro? Where are you saying? Where are you now bro? Can't find you, can't find you I forgot you came off the pitch You in VAR, you look and go grab a hotel And do what you have to do Because both of you try to come beat Arsenal But you failed bro, you failed <laughs> Welcome to White's Tube. This is my thoughts on the game. Alioski and VAR, you lot might as well get a hotel or catch a flight car. I swear, you're not coming to beat Arsenal. You lot might as well go and do your thing because we come, you can't come to our spot. You can't come to our spot and think that you can one shot. You know what I mean? I thought I'd bring out the mic today. I have the mic in my hand because I want you to hear clearly on what I thought on the game. Alioski. He must have thought this was some boxing match because in boxing you chat rubbish and you wanna, you know, hype up your opponent. But you got smoked. You got smoked by Saka. You didn't even have to bring Pepe on. Of course, Saka is better than Pepe in my eyes. But still, how do you feel now? I swear, they should do an interview with him, with Alioski, and see what he has to say. Do you know what I mean? But the one that I want to big up and you know put a bit of respect on his name is Sabias. Sabias, I think he ran the show today. I don't think we needed or missed party. I don't think we missed party at all today. Um, it was a good performance. It's a shame we let in two goals. But Alioski, how do you feel, bro? How do you feel? Do you know what I mean? Valentine's Day and you just got raped by Arsenal and now you can take VAR and and do what you have to do. Do you know what I mean? You can go, yeah, take VAR because VAR, you know they don't like us. Do you know what I mean? Um, Saka, Saka, the first time should have been a penalty. We all know that. You can't say that. You can't say it wasn't a penalty. No one can say that. Do you know what I mean? Apart from VAR, of course, they make the decisions. But they thought, wow, all right. Second time, Saka um, fell over in the box. Let me not sit. Let me not cancel that one, Bakar. That's when there'll be a bit of a bit of heat. Do you know what I mean? So they thought, all right, ah, uh, it's happened twice now. Let's give Saka one of them. Do you know what I mean? But overall, Arsenal performance was good from the get go. What can I say, man? It was good from the get go, and <laughs> we done it. We done it. Do you know what I mean? We got bigger fish to fry. Benfica Thursday, but we'll talk about that today. I'm just gonna talk about the game straight after the match. Um, put in the comments what you feel or what you thought of the match Arsenal fans, Leeds fans and mutual fans Let me hear what you have to say um, And this is going to be a bit of player ratings as well So stay tuned on this channel because we're just taking off So this is just a little start, it's my first little pre Not pre, this is my after match review So yeah, that game today, haha, <laughs> 10 out of 10 Well not 10 out of 10 but no, 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 I'll save that, I'll save that for later. But firstly, I want to start with Leno in goal. Leno in goal. <sighs> Nothing he could have done with the two goals, to be fair. Do you know what I mean? One was a cross and the other one, yeah, they were both crosses to be honest. And they should have been stopped. So I think one was Bellerin. Bellerin should have, Bellerin should have stopped that coming in. So I ain't going to blame Leno for any of the goals. So I'll give him a... 7 out of 10 to be fair um, and on the right Hector Bellerin he scored a goal he done a couple bits on the right hand side but I feel he needs to improve on his defending I think every Arsenal fan knows that and it's just frustrating a bit um, so for him he'll get a 6 out of 10 I'll give him a 6 out of 10 um, David Luiz he saved us it could have been 4-3 if, if you know what I'm talking about he, someone, I forgot my man who crossed it in and he got there just in front. So big up to David Luiz. I think we should give this guy a new deal. That's what I think. Um, Wipes Tube's thoughts, that's what I think. Um, tell me what you think. Should we give David Luiz another another year, or another two years? What do you think? Or do you think this is just another, give him a year or two and then he's dead? Who knows? But David Luiz, I'll give him a eight out of 10. I think he was solid to be fair. Um, Gabriel, I think, you know what, I swear, I don't know if I'm wrong, let me know in the comments, but do we always concede when Gabriel plays? That's what I've kind of noticed. 
when Rob Holden plays, I swear we, we can get some clean sheets, but every time we play, he plays, we concede a goal or two. I don't know, or am I just, am I losing my head? But let me know in the comments what you think, or am I, am I bullshitting or whatever, let me know. Um, but I'll give Gabriel a 7 out of 10. I think David Luiz was better today. Um, on the left hand side, Cedric. Cedric, Cedric. Um, I think we missed Tenny. I think this this is only temporary. We cannot like think like this can work because I don't think it works. Let me know in the comments again what you think. Does it work? Does it not work? Let me know. Um, but I'll give him a six out of ten. Um, Granite Shaka. I think he was solid. I think he was solid. Um, I didn't see any thoughts with his performance. I give him a seven out of ten. The one that stood out for me is Sobias. Put respect on his name. I keep saying this. Um, people always want to talk about Partey this, Partey that. Respect Sobias, please, because this guy is a baller. No one can say he ain't a baller. Pull it in the comments again, because I want you to let me know what you think. Do you know what I mean? All my wife's tubers. That's what I made up last show. So my wife's tubers, let me know what you think of Sobias. Well, I think he's... I think he's top notch to be fair. Um, it's the way he moves, it's the way he's just so, he's just so slick with certain things, you know what I mean? There was one time where the ball came and he dummied it and it just went past two man. Do you know what I mean? I think he's just, I think he's good man. I think we should sign him to permanently. Um, let me know again what you think. Should we sign him permanently or get another a loan? But all these loans, I think we need to start get these guys to put some pen on some paper now, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, that's what I think about Sobias. Um He was on the right hand side, Saka, main man Saka. I swear, this guy, this guy don't look like the same kid from when we first saw him. Of course, he's gonna grow up a bit in it, but this guy looks like a man now. He looks like he's ready for the Premier League and he's only gonna get better. He's only 19. The sky is the limit with this kid, man. What can I say? The sky is the limit. It's just, um, it's crazy. I bet you any money, if he was Argentinian or a young Argentinian guy, he would be all across Europe. Everyone would be talking about, um, if he had some fancy name like, I don't know, Ronaldinho or Mezzidinho or whatever. People will be talking about this Mezzidinho, he's ripping it up in the Premier League, etc., or whatever, or anywhere. Um, let's buy him for 90, 80, 90 or 100 mil. Do you know what I mean? Because it's Saka. I don't know. Tell me what you think as well. Is it? Is he getting the ratings that he should be getting? I don't know. Let me know. Um, who was there? Who else was there? There was Odegaard. Odegaard. He came into it. Obviously, you can't judge a man on one Premier League performance. Obviously, he's coming to the hardest league. Um... And it's his first game. First game, you can't really rate him too tough. You can't really be, a, be yeah, you can't, you can't judge him too much on that. Um, it was his first Premier League start and it was against a Leeds team that was, yeah, they just attack and they can't defend. You know, that, that's, that's what everyone knows for Leeds, you know what I mean? But Odegaard, I give him a six out of 10. I think, I see little bits of him that could be raw, all right. Um, he could be good for us, do you know what I mean? It's, um, it's good to have another left footer. It kind of reminds me of Ozil, but like a uh, energy, energy Ozil. Um, but yeah, that's six out of ten. Smith Row. That was a good assist to Aubameyang. Was that a shot? Was that a goal? I don't know. <laughs> what do you not think? Was that a shot or a goal? It, I don't know. The commentators said it looked like a shot, but when you look at it slowly, it looked like my man was looking at Aubameyang. And going oh, like all right cool bang and he done it um who else was there so i'll give him a i'll give him a seven out of ten to be fair um oh yeah saka did i say saka's one saka i'll give him a nine out of ten um a bamiyang hat trick put respect on this guy's name as well people are talking about oh is this another ozzel situation where we're just giving him a contract and he's just going to be going downhill. Do 
you know what I mean? Ban all of that talk, man. Ban all of that. Ban all of that. He, he's our main he's our main player. He's our main player, main striker, and he's our captain. Respect of Bamian. 10 out of 10 for me. Um, and yeah, subs. Subs will go with William came on. Um, I know there's bare William haters out there. I'm not a William hater. I want him to succeed. Of course, he's not playing well, but I just want him to succeed. But I don't think he done much. Um, I'm not contradicting myself, but like, I just don't think he done much um, on the time he came on. I give him a five out of ten. Um, who else was there? Uh, Mohamed Oneni didn't really see much of him as well. Um, five out of ten. And Rob Holden, he just came to just show up the thing, make sure the boat sells. And yeah, that was a five out of ten for me as well. Um, yeah, let me know what you think. Did I get the player ratings right? Who do you think should have got higher? Who do you think should have got lower? Let me know in the comments. Want to interact with you. And yeah, it was a, it's a W. It was a W. We needed this, you know. Benfica Thursday. Roll it on. What team do we start against that? I don't know. I don't know. What team do we start? Mm. I don't know, but that's going to be another show coming up. We're going to do a match build up to that one. Make sure you keep it locked on Wipes Tube. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like. Make sure you comment. Yeah, just just keep it locked. Just keep it locked on Wipes Tube, man. Keep it locked on Wipes Tube. We've got a lot, a lot still, a lot coming up. So, want to interact and see what you think. All my gooners, yeah, stay locked, man. Stay locked. So, yeah, I think 4-2. Good result, good result. But yeah, apart from that, I'm out of here, man.